We can't be seen from the path. Let's wait here to see where Constantine goes. Look, he's coming. Constantine, what are you doing? Cousin! You're here! I, I, I would have preferred that you learn all of this another way. To be able to reveal everything to you in better circumstances. But whatever power we earn, there are some things that escape us. I have no idea what you're talking about, but what are you doing here? I seem monstrous to you. I am well aware of that. But I promise to explain everything when the moment is right. Then you will understand. You will see. The temptation is so great to share all with you right now. You have done so much for me. You have given me so much. I haven't forgotten, believe me. But I still have more to do. Forgive me and have patience. Hold them back. But do not kill him for anything in the world. Constantine, come back and explain yourself. He's the one contaminating the guardians. He's the one responsible for the attacks. So mad. It's the only explanation. Your armor will no longer protect you. But I don't understand. What he wants. Eternity. Strength. Power. It is what they all want. Those who take good out looking beyond themselves. Like all those from the faraway lands. He wasn't like that. He couldn't care less about all that. Then it is the sickness. The brevity of his existence that terrified him to the point it changed who he is. You must stop him. Each time that he bonds, he destroys me a little more. And with me, the hope for a cure. 
And now it's my heart, my most sacred sanctuary that he covets. You must kill him. It is madness. The consequence of his folly, yes. Believe me, there is no other solution. Stop him, flesh of my earth, or there will be nothing left to save. I still can't believe this. Even if I hesitate to follow the orders of a talking stone, I know what I saw, and I fear that this thing has not lied to us. What your cousin is doing is horrific, and he must be stopped. We must learn more if we want to understand his plans and prepare against them. This hiding place he was talking about in his notes. We must find it. Don't forget, he has a personal guard. He's bound to have warned them against us after what happened. You're right. We should be careful. And we're gonna need an army. Alone, against all of these creatures, will be no match for them. The natives will follow us. What do you think about the Norts? I would like to answer you myself, but alas, I cannot. The question will have to be asked to the Admiral. I'm truly disgusted at the idea of asking for help from that Viper Torsten, but his men would be useful. And we could, of course, go and find Governor Buren. <sighs> what an absurd project. On the continent, they would brand us crazy, but not here. On an island where everything is possible and all folly is accepted. Let us go. We need to put an end to all of this. <laughs> Hello, Your Eminence. Your Excellency. What can I do for you? We need your help. Are you trying to flatter me? Or are you mocking me in my disgrace? Neither, Your Eminence. Our situation is so dire that we need all the allies we can get. As you probably know, my cousin was afflicted by the Malachor and saved from it by a native ritual. He hasn't been himself since. And he now has a thirst for power that is pushing him towards the most extreme decisions. So, we were right to be wary of the demons of this island. To survive, your cousin has made a pact with them, and if I understand correctly, all of us will have to pay for it. It's a bit more complicated than that. But yes, we may all pay the price for his madness. Alas, I have no priests or inquisitors that I could send to support you. But I can give you this. What is it? A piece of jewelry, blessed in Teleme. It will be useful if you want to summon the power of the Enlightened. May he protect you in this fight, Desade. I will pray for your success. Thank you, Your Eminence. Do you need anything else? I must leave you. Of course.
De Sarde, what can I do for you? I have come to ask for your help, Admiral. My cousin has been plunged into madness, and he apparently wishes to conquer the whole island. He took control of many creatures by reenacting rituals he learned from the islanders, and now he uses them to attack the cities and the villages of those he considers to be his rivals. A difficult situation, admittedly, but one that does not concern us. Who's in charge of the island is none of our business, De Sarde, and you know that. It actually does concern you. If my cousin takes control of the island, soon there will be no ports where your ships can berth. He's not looking for political influence. He desires power. Absolute power. I see. It's a decent argument. So what now? We must stop him at all costs. And for that, I will need allies. I intend to convince other factions to support me. But I was hoping I could count on the help of the Norts. Alas, even if I wanted to, I couldn't send you my men. They don't trust you enough to follow you and fight on land. Could there be a way to make them change their mind? Captain Reuben warned me that he suspected a member of his crew of being a spy. It is almost certain she sent secret navigation information to foreigners. Why ask me to take care of it? This is a very serious accusation. One that results in a member of the guild being expelled. The Norts are like a family, very connected, but also likely to carry resentment. I think an external view is required to be certain that there will be no bias. Anyway, their ship is anchored at New Serene. Your authority will allow you to get more answers than us. I see. What is the exact nature of the information that could have been sent? It's up to you to find out. But all the Noughts know how we navigate our ships. You've seen the techniques we use, and you know we want to keep them secret. I agree. Where can I find Captain Reuben? At the port in your town. You know his ship. It was Captain Vasco's before he landed. Very well. I will do my best. Even though time is running out. I expect nothing less of you. See you later, De Sarde. Captain Reuben? Aye, the man himself. To whom do I have the honor of speaking? De Sade, legate of the merchant congregation. And I'm sure you know my companion. Vasco? Oh, do not worry. The seahorse is in good hands. I'm sure, Reuben. What brings you here? The Admiral asked me to shed light on your little problem of indiscretion in your ranks. I see. I would be happy to answer any questions you have. You told the Admiral that you suspect one of your crew members. Indeed. The young apprentice sailor, Alba. A committed volunteer from Teleme. Ah, she only joined us a short time ago. Did you want to know anything else? The Admiral told me that you were the new captain of the ship we arrived on. The Seahorse? Yes. It's an excellent ship and a good crew. But you did the crossing. You know it as well as me. Did you want to know anything else? That'll be all, Captain. Thank you. What brings you here? The Admiral asked... I see. All right. What led you to these suspicions? Well, the girl's behavior. She was very eager at first, very willing, almost too much. Then, suddenly, she became nervous. She isolated herself, and did not speak to others. She's a recent recruit, which inevitably raised some doubts about her vocation. Sometimes I saw her hanging around my cabin. My papers were often disturbed. And since we've returned to port, she's almost never on board. Well, you can understand my concern, but you should probably talk to the other members of the crew. They may know something else. Ultimately, 
Your strong suspicion stems from the fact that she's sea-given. A recent sea-given. She did not join us as a child, but you know how rare volunteers are, especially from Talaymi. Did you want to know anything else? Do you know what information she may have sent? I don't know exactly what you know about our navigation methods. Let's say that magic does not have much to do with it. I see. Well, of course she knows that too. She saw some of our machines on board. And by searching through my papers, she could get even more sensitive information. Did you want to know anything else? That'll be all, Captain. Desarde, I've always hoped to one day find... But, I... Could you go there and bring the file to... Another time, maybe. I understand. Did you want anything else? I must leave you. Desarde, what can I do for you? Admiral, did you think any more about my alliance proposal? I told you that I would reconsider my decision if you did us a favor. I'm still waiting. Unfortunately, I don't have enough time. That's regrettable. In which case, allow me to wish you good luck, Desarde, and to give you this. This outfit saved my life several times. Alas, it is all I can do for you. Thank you, Admiral. I'll make good use of it. The cave that Constantine indicated in his note shouldn't be very far. Let's be careful. We probably Yeah! Get the poison on my blade! 
Constantine has marked several places on this map. I recognize some of them. They are sacred places for the natives, places of connection. This place, this journal. My poor Constantine, you have completely lost your mind. What are you hoping to achieve with these rituals? According to the Donegada, each bond gives some form of power to the one who makes it. Your cousin never has enough, apparently. So much so that he's threatening Enon Mil and himself. He wants to take his place. <sighs> to think he's been plotting this absurd plan for weeks. He even used us to achieve it. The intruder in the sanctuary was certainly sent by him to scout the place. We'll need to gather allies if we're going to stop him. But we will also have to weaken him and break apart the bonds that he's established. Even though I've studied the rituals of the natives, I really don't know how to proceed. I can only think of one person that could help us. Dunkus. Mev is too hostile towards strangers. You're right. Let's go and find him. What brings you here on Omanawi? I need your help. You may have heard about the strange guardians who are leading the animals to attack everyone. Yes. Daren of the Donea Exregal sent me a messenger to tell me about it. It is the work of my cousin. He completed the bonding ritual in several places on the island. Every time he bonds himself, he becomes more powerful, transforms the guardians and sends them to attack his enemies. And he weakens the island and threatens us all. Katasach and Evosh Tire should never have bonded him. His spirit is not in balance. The only thing he does is take and take again. He will eventually devour everything. Enon Mil Frichtemann did warn me that he would now turn his attention to the heart of the island. What are you planning on doing and how may I help? We're gathering our allies, but if we want to stop him, we'll have to weaken him. And break some of his bonds. I see. I will have to talk about this with the rest of the Donegada, and hope that they will answer my call. But in the meantime, the Beraignodas will accomplish their duty. However, we will need your help. What can I do? During the ritual, the one who is bonding himself spills some of his blood near the base of a stone. And this blood summons a guardian. The guardian lifts the stone so that it may serve as an anchor point for the bond. The only way to break this bond is to have a guardian topple the stone. We will be able to do it, but these rituals take a long time. Too long to be done quickly. So, in the meantime, you must prevent your cousin from drawing magic from the place. Here, take these seeds and plant them at the bottom of your cousin's bonding stones. These plants grow very fast, and their roots will prevent him from drawing the strength of Tiefradi. However, you must be careful, because the guardians corrupted by him will come to defend the stones. Thank you, Dunkers. And thank you for wanting to stop your cousin. Don't worry. 
I will send my people to finish the work of the plants I have given you. I must admit that I expected Dunkus to be more angered when he learned what Constantine had done. He is an intelligent man. He must have guessed the purpose of our visit before we even spoke to him. I almost regret not choosing him to become High King. gave us at the base of the raised stone. Look! The plant seems to be growing extremely fast. The Donnegada of Dunkus's clan are sure to be here soon to finish breaking the bond. <laughs> 